right, going what kind down. Of seats are these? Kind of feels like a normal Lamborghini almost, but you're trying to trick me right now. <laughs> What's going on, JR Garage? Welcome back to the channel and welcome to the beginning of what should be a very, very fun vlog because we are meeting up with the Strad man. So it's gonna be a super fun day. He texted me this morning that he's in town. He is in Scottsdale and he says, yo, do you wanna link up? I'm meeting up with Nyla and her dad who also have Lamborghinis and we're going on a little Lamborghini cruise. So I'm like, oh, we just happen to have a Lamborghini. Like, let's definitely join. So he says we're free to come by and if I'm lucky, I'm gonna try to get James to sit shotgun and give him an insane full send in the twin turbo Lamborghini. And as you guys know, he is getting his Lamborghini twin turbo, so I, I wanna give him a little sneak peek of what it's like in the, in the boosted life. <laughs> We're gonna convince him to yeah. get his car back really soon. So Christian's down there on the ground because we actually removed the rocker panel so that we could repaint it because it has some chips right there from the accident and now Stradman texted us so we're like okay forget repainting the rocker panel we're throwing it back on so that we can take this car. I guess I could start by moving out the 430 because that's in the way. This will give us a cold start of the loudest F430 in the world. Sorry James it is louder than your 430. Keys, keys, keys. Okay which Ferrari key is it? The old one. Yes, yes this one I think. Okay good thing it's a Sunday because we're no longer allowed to start this car during business hours. That's how loud it is so Sunday we're good to go. Full send. Rest in peace headphones users. For everyone new to the channel, this is our 2005 Lamborghini Gallardo gated six-speed manual with the Underground Racing 2R package. Two 71 millimeter precision turbos and it can run four different tunes, 93, MS109, and then the two insane tunes, Q16 tunes, and the top one being 40 PSI on this V10. Fully built, fully built trans. This car was a former world record holder in 2014, 2015 for various roll races, half mile events. At one point, UGR had it tuned at 2200 wheel horsepower. So I think that should be plenty to scare James. So let's proceed into a beautiful edit going through Arizona. Here we go. Let's go get some lunch. Ooh. Oh, I like the sound of that. What's up, man? There we go. Alex. Uh, Jeff, nice to meet Jeff. you. All right, everyone, we just finished up some amazing canes for the food vlog, but check this out. We got all the Lambos lined up, so Nyla's gonna be driving the SV. We got the Countach. James was driving this earlier. His vlog is gonna be super sweet. Huracan, LP640, and the UGR. Now, I think I got James to agree to come with me in the UGR. We gotta scare him in the UGR, and he's gotta know what he's in for when he twin turbos his car. Dap you up. See ya. Can't wait to see more of this bad boy. Straight pipe cool Oh my. Oh. All right, that's a that's how a real Lamborghini sounds. Oh yeah, V12 Lambos. Something about a V12 straight pipe Lambo doesn't get better than that. I want one. One day, I will have, I will have an LP640. Are you ready for this? What do you think James' reaction is going to be? Oh, he's going to freak out. All right. All aboard. Going down. What kind down. of seats are these? Uh, They're like that thin. Yeah. Bro, you know how old I am. I got a bad back. I'm just kidding. I'm good. Stock seats weigh like 40 pounds, 45 pounds each, yeah. I think. Something like that. These are six and a half oh, pounds. Oh, jeez. That's insane. That's so much savings. Have you ever been to UGR Lambo? I don't think so. Oh I've been in another boy. twin turbo, but it wasn't UGR, it was a Hefner. I 
Okay. Yeah. You're in for a treat then. I mean, I don't know what the Hefner one was like, but something about UGR, just the way they sound <laughs> yeah. and move, and one of the yeah, craziest ones they've what, ever created. A thousand wheel horsepower. Yeah, just about. All pump gas. Yeah, that, that's just tune number one. Jeez. This is the baby tune, so keep that in mind tune? as we go. Okay, we're going to have to come back for the, the grown up tune, I guess. Yes, right? come again soon. But it's been a little while. This is the first time we've been together in Arizona. So yeah, this is cool. It is. Finally, this is the first time you've ever been in one of my cars. That's crazy. I've been in is your it? cars. Yeah, because we've always met like away from. Yeah, well, where we, we met live. in Florida. Right. You came to Utah on the Aston. Uh huh. We've seen each other at Car Week. Yeah, but yeah, you're right. But I'm, I'm just glad that we have the fire extinguisher. Yeah, and trust just me, like I can pull. I, if I need to. It's right you, there. You can count on me. Okay. So I mean, low RPMs kind of feels like a normal Lamborghini almost, but... You're trying to trick me right now. I know no, what you're up to. <laughs> you're going to be just granting it and then you're going to take off. That's yeah, completely normal. Uh, totally stock, unmodified, yeah, slow. Yeah, I bet. I've uh, seen enough underground racing YouTube videos uh, to know what I'm in for. <laughs> Give, to make you like 
be hungry for years. I know. I can't like, wait. It's like, wait, it's March first, so we got two months. It's gonna be a long two months, but it's right around the corner. Well, wait. here's what you have to expect. And awesome, uh, thanks, dude. Wait to see you get yours. That was sick. All right, let's go. Uh, let's go check out Nyla's last couple cars in the garage yeah. and uh, see where they take us. Oh, the dog's picking its favorite. Come on, come on, go to the Gallardo. Yes, yes, yes. No, no. Go, go, go. She's gonna go to the rolls. What are you gonna? Oh, your oh, favorite? oh. Ah, oh, dang it. That's your favorite, good girl. That dog's got taste, likes the classic. Come on, I gave you a treat to pick the Gallardo. What you doing? This is goodbye. Yes, goodbye. Pew, pew, pew. Sound effects. You made your editing easier. Yeah. Sound yeah, 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 yeah. All right, can't wait for you to twin turbo your Gallardo. Yes. Okay, vlog, of course, the next stop is back at the gas station to get some more 100 octane racing fuel, which comes at the bargain up. Eight dollars and nineteen cents a gallon, dude. Eight dollars and nineteen cents. That's that's a steal, man. You can't beat that. Um, yeah, that's quite expensive, but it it, it it only takes the best. You gotta feed it the best. Oh, how you doing? Is this your car? Oh yeah. Nice oh, to see you can guys. I get like a picture of it? Like it's my dream car. Um, I guess. I'm usually oh. I charge, but this yeah, you're looking like you're trying to lay low key, with paparazzi, oh. like sunglasses. Like, are you someone famous? Follow us on TikTok, Jared Garage, and drives with Aves and Kieran O'Brien and all of us. And uh, yeah, about to be a viral TikTok right here. So stay tuned. Check it out. Behind the scenes of TikTok. Drive with Aves filling up her Lamborghini Gallardo with 100 octane race gas. This is about to get a million views. Fuel stop, check. We back up to a full tank. Yup, yes sir. We're good for another 100 miles now. All right, full tank of gas, let's go burn it off in Mexico. over there. What is that, the 10th Lamborghini of today? Oh, this dude's taking a selfie, or he's getting a picture with the Aventador and our car in the background. Double Lambo. TikTok? I, hear, I heard something about TikTok. He's making a TikTok. Guys, he's filming a TikTok. There you go. Just wait right here, we're fine. Yeah. Yo, we're the prop of a TikTok right now. Got it? All right, see ya. Yo, that was a first. I've never been the background of a TikTok. All right, guys, we are back. And speaking of TikToks, we are actually going to be filming a couple more TikToks. We're about to hit 300K, so get us 300K on TikTok. That would be greatly appreciated. What a fun day that was. Yeah, it's always a great time with Stradman, whether we're up in Utah or he's down in Arizona or we meet somewhere else. You know, cars bring us to a lot of different places. And so really enjoy meeting up with all the YouTubers. Yeah, such an awesome guy. He's always down for just fun stuff. I said, hey, sit, go out in the UGR. And I even, I even said he could drive it. But like he said, he doesn't want to ruin all the fun for when he gets his twin turbo car. He wants to save that first time for his car, so that makes sense. Please, guys, be sure to subscribe. We got more stuff coming with this car. We got stuff coming with the CL600, which is parked right over here. It's getting really bad. We have so many cars outside. It's only a matter of time until our landlord and neighbors tell us to get another garage, which will happen soon anyway. We got the CL600 here. We got the S600, so a bunch is going down. So if you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button, guys. It would be greatly appreciated. Also, leave a big like on this video. Likes do a lot for the YouTube algorithm, so if you guys get this video, 10,000 likes or something. You guys are awesome, so that would be appreciated. And last but not least, we need you guys to comment down below. Should we keep the green UGR for the long term, or do we need to consider selling it? We've gone back and forth in our head. If you guys are seriously interested, we've kind of come up with like, ah, maybe we're trying to get like a 150 for it, which is reasonable given that a Verde stick car non-turbo, just a stock car, is probably nearly worth 150 given how rare they are. So you just get 400K worth of twin turbos for free at that price. So I don't know if we sell it, clean title car. We just got the title and plates and everything for it. Let us know what you guys think. Maybe we'll keep it. It's gonna be hard to replace if we ever get rid of it. That's the only problem. Yeah, yeah, we could do a couple builds with that money, but I don't know if we can do a build quite like that again. A beautiful day today, 10 Lambos and a nice Sunday afternoon. Makes for a fun vlog. So hope you guys enjoyed. Subscribe if you're new. We'll see you guys in the comment section down below. See you in the next one. It feels right.